What's poppin'? Brand new whip just hopped in. I got options. I can pass that beat like stocking. Just joshing. I'ma spend this holiday locking. My body got rid of them toxins. Sports in the top ten. I can put a ball in the end zone. Put a bad bitch in the friend zone. Hey y'all. So I just got a package. I just got off of work or whatever, and I had a package that was delivered. I hope it's what I think it is, okay? So I want to open up with my um, box cutter. Yo. Yo. So y'all already know that Valentine's Day is coming up. And I really, really do think that every every lady deserves a Teddy Blake's bag. <laughs> so yeah, this is one of my dream designs, most definitely. With a team of Italian designers pitched from well-known luxury brands, Teddy Blake creates handbag designs for every style choice. If you don't see your Teddy Blake yet, then I mean, y'all should subscribe. They release new collection every month. Their designers work very hard to develop new unique designers while also trying to keep the price point to affordable. So now this is my Teddy Blake bag that I got. This is the Ava Croco Gold 11 inch in white by Teddy Blake. And I really love this bag, y'all. It feels so good in my hand. It's lightweight. It's luxury. Like, I really feel like Y'all should get this bag for Valentine's Day or just or just because get for yourself. So since it's Valentine's Day, you can enjoy a luxury Valentine's discount store to get 45% off. But let's say for instance that you missed a Valentine's Day sale. That's cool with me. We got you. You can use discount code TBNick for $30 off your next purchase. Y'all should go and cop it. TBNick30 for $30 off. Thanks, Teddy Blake, for sitting over this luxury handbag. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to our channel. Y'all hear me in the background? Y'all hear y'all knees to the background? Shut up on my brother. So, excuse her being loud mouth. So, anyways, welcome back to our channel. Today's with my very first Sheen clothing try on haul. Because I want to see how these things fit on me. And this is specifically for my short women that's on a thicker side i mean this can be for any type of body type but this is specifically for my show women i just want to show y'all the things that i prefer to wear like for my body type or whatever the case is and how i disguise the fupa dupa you know what i'm saying the fupa dupa so i just want to show y'all those things and hold on i didn't even get no intro if y'all are new Hey y'all, if y'all all the book of this, welcome, 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 welcome back, my la babies. <laughs> no, but for real though, um, excuse these things in my glass. I need, I, girl, I try to record with all my glasses, but the ring light, I need them. I, I ain't gonna be able to see y'all. So, let's get straight into this sheen haul. And I hope y'all enjoy. This is my first one. Tell me how I do. Just tell me how I do. Put it right this is like a flannel that i had got um it's brown blue and like a white color the button they have buttons on it i got this in a size large which i should have gotten in a size medium because i'm not gonna wear it as a um a shirt i'm only gonna wear it as like a, a cover-up like a um it's gonna be it's gonna always be open nia you loud so it's gonna always open it. So that's why I'm like, okay, maybe I need to get a large because in sheen clothes, I'm not sure what size, the exact size that I wear. So when I buy things, I buy it in a large. Just to be sure that I can fit it or whatever. Because I know sometimes when I get mediums, it's just like mm-mm. But this is more like almost like a wool material. Um, you get how this hell up in here. I actually wore this before. I'll make sure that I Put that up here somewhere. I styled this already because after this video, I'm going to do a style with me with these items and whatever. And it's a whole other video, girl. So, I really, really like this. Um, the next thing is these faux pants. Um, They have the little elastic at the bottom. And I think I got these in a size... This is in a size medium. 
because pants wise, sometimes I can well, sometimes I can wear medium it depends. That's why when you shop on Sheen, by you being short and thick or any other type of body shape, when you shop on Sheen or a website that you that you're not familiar with, always look in the description bar or what type of material it is. Because I had to figure out that full is really stretchy so you can always size down with fold but if you want to do a safe size size up if you want to but i was preferring when you when it say fold and it say stretch like full stretches so when you're looking for them little leather pleather pants that do stretch so i would always size down and they have the elastic band in the um in the waist part and they have this little cute little line this is more like a baby powder blue and I really love this, which I told y'all that I paired it. I paired it. I styled it with the flannel that I had. So, and I love this. They have the drawstring. This right here is a chocolate color jacket, maybe? But it came with an ankle length, um... What you want to call this? A dress? An ankle dress. And I really love this. And they have like the split up the middle. I got this in a size medium because they did say that it stretched. So like I told y'all before, when they say stretch, you can always size down or get the side that you think that you need. If it say don't stretch, always size up. So this is very, very cute. And they have this. I feel like you can wear it either way. No, I'm lying. But they have this, this how the this how the front look. This is the back. And they have the they have the split right here. And the jacket that goes over it. For us women, that's like not too much confident in our arms and stuff like that. We prefer to have something covered up. This shawl, shield, jacket, whatever. You can do this with this. But like I said, it's like a chocolate color. The material is like a cotton, maybe. And these are the elastic, I mean, not the elastic, the little, yeah, elastic ones. And this is very, very cute on me. I mean, with this, I will most definitely, like, even though I think that the medium size fit, I will probably size up because, like, I don't like my fupa showing for real, for real. But you can still do, you can still do your regular, regular size. If you, if you wear um undergarments like girdles, if you wear like girdles, I don't wear girdles. So, like I said, in this particular thing, I would have sized up because this, and then some of this stuff, I'm just going, like, I'm just getting out of my comfort zone, especially with something like this. I'm not really too, you know, I'm not really fond into things that's skin tight to me. This is like, it's not skin tight, but it's like, it's perfect. But I would have sized up, but I could, I, I'm going to keep the medium. I'm good with the medium. I'm good with the medium, but I would have sized up with this. So, like I said, if you wear any type of foundation underneath, like, yeah, uh, you can keep your regular size, but if you don't, size up. Hope that makes sense. So, let me put this back up here, this girl. I ain't gonna put it back up in there. What I have another two piece. These are pants. It's like a tan color. A tan color. And I got this in a size medium so cute so cute so this is the pants this is good for short women short thick women that want something that's kind of fitting us but also like loose this is very very soft i really really love this so it also came with this long sleeve shirt and they have like the splits on the side, which will give us some type of um, shape. Anything that has splits on the sides that's high up, which supposed to snatch our waist in a little bit, that'll be that that really that really really help us, y'all. That really help us. And the neck is cute. I just really love this. this. is very very soft. Like I said, I got this in a medium. You don't need no girdle with this. Only thing I don't like about it is the fact that it's almost sheer. Like, you can see my bra and um, drawers, but it doesn't matter about the drawers part because you have the little openings that's covering your butt, but this also make your butt look big, y'all. But 
you know, but your top wise, you as you can tell, you can see the pants. You can see the cut of the pants in it because of the how um see through it is. It's a thin material. It's a thin material, but it's a thin material, but thick material. It keep you warm, sis. It keep you warm. So I really, really love this two piece. One of one of my favorites, I would say. This is another two-piece that I got. My favorite. And the only reason why I got this off is because it reminded me of a Skims set. I have not bought a Skims set yet because I just have it. But I love this. It's a chocolate color two-piece set. It's a Love More 1992 without without you that's what it says so yeah it's in a chocolate color i really really love this this is um only thing about it like i said this is stretch this is stretch i could have done who i did a large oh this is a medium i could have done a small in the pants this is the shirt Cute shirt. I really, really love the neck part. That's pretty, pretty, pretty. The sleeves. The bottom also say Love More 1992 without you. I love this shirt. Now, like I said, I think this shirt is in a medium because I bought the set together. Yeah. I could have done a small in the pants and a large in the shirt because sometimes a sticker women will like wide backish you know what i'm saying then our arms are big so we need like more space so you might be like nigga you ain't that big baby i know i'm funky i'm gonna just say it. i'm keep i keep it real with myself you can't buy them separate and i hate that but i really love this because it looks almost like a skim set the next thing is this skirt y'all i really really love this skirt now I got this skirt in a size medium. I could have gotten this skirt in a large. But it's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's, it's not bad. And it came with the strength because it strapped up the thigh, which is so sexy to me, y'all. It's so sexy. So I would recommend that y'all, if you do purchase anything like this, size up. Size up with this. Even though in the description bar, it do say stretch. You need to go a size up. I mean, but anyway, but, I mean, at, at the same time, this may be a mini skirt. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not into mini skirts, mini skirts. So, like I said, I would have sized up. That's just my preference. But if you are into, you know what I'm saying, like mini skirts, short, short, real form fitting, then stick with your regular, regular size. So, like I said, I got this in the medium. Super, super cute. This is the strength that wrap up the leg. Love it. So the next thing is these faux leather pants. Love it. Love them, love them, love them. They have the zipper on the side. So I was like, I got these in a large. I feel like I could have sized down to a medium, but the large is fine. Because I feel like if I would have done a medium, they would have fit correctly. But the fupa would have been fupa in, in these pants. And sometimes we don't want that. All the times we don't want that. We don't, I ain't going to say sometimes. All the time we don't want that. So, like I say, size up if you want more of a comfortable fit. I mean, but I mean, if not, then do your regular size or whatever the case is. But I got a large. I could have done a medium, but I got a large so that my fupa don't be too much exposed. I'm not into that. Uh, Cause like I said, I don't wear um girdles or anything like that. So these are so cute. This is faux. I told y'all before. Faux do stretch. So faux do stretch. That's why I said you can either size up if you want to. But if you wear medium, get your medium. Or if you wear large, get your large. If you want to. But if you're not interested in your fupa being fupering, get you an extra large. It's still gonna fit. And then, like, the more you wear full leather, the more it stretch out. So, keep that in mind when you do size up. 
Okay, the next thing is this super cute two-piece that I got. Black and white two-piece. This, this is a skirt, a skirt, a skirt. I did not know that, y'all. It have a zipper on the side. When I was looking at it on sheet, I did not know it was a skirt. I didn't even read that in there. But they do have shorts. I could have did, I could have sized up in the, um, in the bottoms. What size did I get in this? This is a medium. I could have done a large, but I can still fit it. Y'all know our body types be tricky as hell. So, you know, I can still fit it. Don't get me wrong. This is super, super cute. This is this. And it came with this shirt. This is so cute, y'all. This is so cute. And the shirt say regular. But this is super cute. I'm going to still wear it. Like, like I said, I got this in a medium. Y'all could size up if y'all want to. I would preferably say size up. If you have bigger thighs, size up, girl. Because, like, my baby was like, that's too small. I looked at her like, girl, wait on. You can't fit that. So, definitely size up if y'all. No, I'm going to say size up. Next thing is this puff vest. So, watch, watch how stylish, y'all. Just watch. Watch out, stylus. This is the puff vest jacket, whatever you want to call it, in an orange color. That's what I call it. And I got this in a size large. Now, don't size down. Either get a large or an extra large, okay? Either get a large or an extra large. If you wear medium, I mean, like I said, if you small, I mean, do your thing. But if you are more of a, on the thicker side like me, and you think you wear medium, don't get no medium. Get a large. Or you can get an extra large. Because these jackets right here, don't matter how big they is, it's still going to look cute. Still going to look cute. But it's going to look funny as hell if it's smaller. Period. So even if you do just be like, okay, be on the same side, I'm going to get an extra large. It's still going to look cute. It's still going to look cute. If you at medium, get a large. Thank you, Emmy. Get a large. But this is so cute. It's it's not. And they have these little drawstrings because you can pull them a little tight around the waist. This is going to be so cute. It's like a thicker material. It'll keep you on. Next thing is this green shirt that I am in love with. Look at the pattern, y'all. So cute. And I got this in a size large. If you only wear it as a jacket or like a pullover, you can size down. Because I should have gotten a medium, which the large isn't bad. But I would prefer a medium. So this could be a little short and, and, and a little less baggy. But I did get these in a large to be on the safe side. Because my arms be tricky. My arms and my back. Because I can sometimes shirts and stuff be tight around my back and my arms. Because... You know, we're short and we're thick, we're on proportion, but we still find his hair, we still bomb. But we try to like, you know, get things that's comfortable around our back because by our arms being bigger, you have to size up to fit those things. So usually if I'm in the store trying things on, I try it on and I do like I'm hugging somebody because that's the only time it be too tight is when we try to hug or when we do like something like this, we feel it in the back pulling. This is going to be a prime example of what I meant when I said shirts that's too small. That's a, this is it. This is a cute bell bottom sleeve shirt. This is the material, the designs in it, super duper cute. Now, and they have uh, buttons at the back. Now, I, it is more like it's a crop top. I got this in a size large. It's mixed, it's giving mixed feelings. It's giving mixed feelings because, like I say, it's long in the front and short in the back. But also, it's a little bit too tight on my arms. So, I probably, most definitely would have gotten an extra large or extra, extra large in this. Because it's like, it's no, it's no stretch to it. It's no, 
it's no stretch to it. Like, it's no type of stretch. No type of stretch. So, size up if you purchase this shirt or anything like this. Size up one size or two size because it is a crop top. And the arms part is just not given. All up here, it's just, it's just not given. You ain't hugging nobody, sis. You, you gonna be like that. You ain't hugging nobody. So, the next thing I got was these shoes, y'all. So cute. They have the silver in the back. I wore these already, y'all, as y'all can tell. Because I told y'all, I paired it. I'll be my little zing the zing. So, I really love these shoes. She, these shoes. It says established in 1989, dear. Um, easy fitting, lasting value. Because y'all know these platform shoes are in style now. And I got these in a white color. And I got these in a size 6, I think. So, I initially wear like a 2.5 to a 3 in like Jordans and stuff like that. Tennis shoes. In heels, I range from a five, five and a half to a six. So, but when I shop online, I always purchase a six. Like, no matter what the shoe is, I'm getting a six. Because I'm not sure, because you, you, you would want to be too big than too small. Never want a too small shoe, because nothing that you can really do with it. So, you always want to stick with, you always want to purchase a size up when you're purchasing shoes from any type of website. I purchase shoes from um, Fashion Nova. I always get a six um, and things like that. So these are super cute. I got the white because you can pair this with anything, y'all. And like I said, I love the fact that it's platform and they are comfortable. I wore these all night, y'all. Ain't they cute? Last time I'm saying, they ain't cute. I'm like, I know these cute. Don't play with me like that. I know they're cute. And the last thing that I got. So the last thing that I'm here to show y'all is this hat. This New York hat. It's almost like a teddy bear material. <laughs> teddy bear fur material. So I got this hat. You know, it's all one size fit all hat. And I really love it. I got a lot of compliments on this hat. New York hat. And... I love it. I wore it. I won't, I'm going to show you on the inside. I think I make up in the inside. But I love this hat. And I got it in the brown to pair with the outfit I showed y'all. Y'all had already seen it. But, like, anytime you get, like, neutral colors, they, they go with anything. So, when you do stuff like that, you're winning, my girl. So, yeah. I love this hat, y'all. And, you know, you can bend the hat however you want to or whatever. Most definitely love this hat. And I'll be wearing it. All the time, probably. When I'm having bad head days. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. So, this is the end of this Sheen try on haul. And I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. This is my first Sheen try on haul, besides the shoe haul that I had. That was with everybody's shoes on there. But this is my first Sheen haul, and I'm so, so happy that I'm able to do these, do these things for y'all. I'm jumping out the box this year, y'all. I'm doing something different on this channel besides vlogs because this is the, what I really want to do, you know. And it's like I really wish they had other people. I don't know other people, but when I'm shopping for clothes, I look for clothes for my shape size. I'm not going to say I'm funny shape, but I'm just being realistic to myself. I'm short and thick, and that's... That's really, you know what I'm saying? That's one of the things that's really rare. You know, most people be tall and thick, you know. But I'm 4'7 and I'm thick as hell. And I want to inspire and empower other women that's my height that really have, like, a self-esteem issue. Because we feel like we're so short that it's just, like, we short and thick. Nothing fits us. So it's really rare that we find things that fit us. And I just want to... Give you other type of content on this channel because I be looking for stuff like that. How can I wear this with a fupa? With a fupa duper? How can I wear this? But let me start rambling up on the road. So yeah, this is the end of this sheen haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and turn your post notification on so whenever me and Nene post, y'all be the first ones to see. So please, please give us a thumbs up. And comment. And matter of fact, meet me in the comments. I'm going to meet y'all in the comments. Make sure you follow all my social media's handles. And yeah. That's it. So, 
Thanks for stopping by my channel. We'll see you in another vlog or in the video. Bye.